can I can I just take you on to uh, which is a related point in fact um, public spending on children um, the Children's Commission has just issued a report which was um, authored by the Institute of Fiscal Studies and part of that uh, report the findings suggested that there's protected spending on um, age 4 to 16 education and on statutory interventions looked after children etc and that is at the expense of targeted preventative measures and the cumulative effect is that more and more statutory interventions are taking place um, not necessarily helpful or supportive interventions um, and less spending going on um, on the more supportive end of the spectrum of spend and that has a uh, almost like a self-fulfilling prophecy where it is a vicious circle and where people uh, involved in social work have to start at the crisis end rather than the supportive end and it does connect up to what Thelma was saying about medication and I just wondered is that a model of spend Secretary of State that you want to see continuing in the future where we're just stepping in uh, when something goes wrong with a most drastic solution rather than trying to have a more considered approach where we're trying to prevent mm. need to intervene. I mean, is that a model of spend that we're going to see continue? Um, well, you are, I mean, undeniably, unarguably right that uh, it is better, obviously, to, uh, to stop a problem happening in the first place generally than to deal with its consequences afterwards. And when we're talking about children's social care and some of the terrible consequences that can happen to, uh, to children in their young lives, I mean, that's all the more important than, uh, than ever. We do have you know, around the country, um, through an innovation fund, uh, we do have um, various different authorities looking at different approaches to this. I visited Grimsby the other day where they had an interesting approach again, working across agencies to try and do some of the, exactly the things that you're talking about to try and stop uh, problems happening in the first place rather than having to, rather than having to as it were, pick up, the, pick up the pieces. So, yeah, I think there is a lot more we can do in, uh, in thinking differently and working differently in innovating. Mm. But I think if we just go back to the, to the spending issue and, and how we spend the existing... Well, budget. that is spend. I mean, that does yeah. involve spending. And that, that is obviously a good thing, and, and the the Grimsby model you mm. refer to is excellent. But I think as a, as a department, if you're simply saying there is a, a pot of money and we have to spend on statutory intervention and we are taking it from preventative, then you're just going to go on creating, the, fueling this problem rather than saying, no, hang on a minute, let's look at this because we, we can't countenance that we're going to have more and more and more children being taken into care because, as you rightly say, that's not something you want to we see. We don't happen. want that to happen, no. So how are we going to stop it? And we're not going to stop it if all social workers have to rely on is, is as a first line of defence, is, well, we're going to intervene with a um, child protection measure. Yeah. or we're going, and, and these measures are not helpful to families very often. Sometimes being put on a child protection register is not helping that family in any way. It's just monitoring them and scrutinising them. And I'm just wondering, yes, there's good, good examples, yes. but until you actually say we're not going to spend the money in this way, then that's not going to change. And, and the Children's Minister, I put the same question to him, and we didn't get an answer in terms of how we're going to change the model, or even if we intend this model to operate in the way that it does. There was no suggestion, or we'll review it, or we'll look at it. And I think that really has to be a first step. Now, how do we spend the money, public money, on children in, in England? And unless we make that uh, decision that we're actually going to physically look at what we do with the budget, we can't change it. Mm. Well, I do give you that commitment to, as you put it, physically look at the, at the, at the problem. Um, I mean, that is an ongoing issue. I mean, it's something also this committee may wish to return. I know this committee has looked at it in the past and may wish to, may wish to look at it again. It's a, it's, a, it's a much bigger topic than something we're going to do as a you know, couple of sentences, you know, back and forth across across I think these you give me the across, I to hear across fact, these tables <laughs> i mean I would, I would observe i mean you do also need to spend money at the uh, you know at the yeah, criti at the, at yeah, the yeah, critical yeah. end uh, and of course the money being spent on the very most vulnerable children has increased uh, over over recent years that's because years. there are more children yes. in care well, and more children on child protection registers which is not a good thing no, that, that, yes that, that, but that, you did give me the answer that, on that, 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 that is that is true but we, but we also need to think about how we, how we get the balance right. Sometimes it is the right decision for a child to go into care, and that is an unavoidable, an unavoidable okay. truth. Uh, but 
to the extent it is possible to avoid that, then obviously for many, many reasons, chief of which is the well-being and development and future of the child, uh, then, of, then of course we must be uh, constantly uh, looking at how we, can, how we can make that work. So you will look at how money is spent um, within, within your budget on children uh, who are at the crisis end relative to preventative measures, because that's what the Children's Commissioner Anne Longfield is, is recommending in her report. Yeah, I, I mean, to be fair, I should just, George, when you say our budget, so, so this, a lot of this is local authority, yeah. there's a lot of it is local authority work, but yes, yes, we will, we do. I mean, it's not, it's not a future tense thing. Um, we do and will continue to uh, look closely uh, at how we can constantly improve the way the system works.